Home Assistant thinks I'm not home. Let's see why. And it's getting cold. So you can see Home Assistant has me away for nine hours. Let me tell you exactly why this is happening. Actually, let me show you. So this is what it is. This is what we got. This is why my house doesn't know where I am. So let's just open it up. We have box. And of course the phone's not there because I'm filming on this phone. But this was the reason. Got a new phone. Let's make it work with Home Assistant. Everything is set up for this new phone. I'm gonna just show you what I need to do to get this to work. Basically, let me show you. I have, let's bring up Adam. I have a file called family. It's a group. So if we go to groups and we go to people, we can see that my family has a device tracker of Carlo. So that's how it tracks me. Now, where we get this is in a file called known underscore devices.yaml. So here's Carlo, here's the Mac, and then here's a picture, track true, and then consider home. Because it's an iOS, sometimes it falls asleep, so we wanna wait 2400 seconds before we decide that, um, that it's done, so, uh, that it's actually sleeping. So. Because I have a new phone, I need to add my new MAC address in here so that it can then track me. There's been lots of new devices. Typically when you find a new device, it will show up here. I'm pretty sure this is the device I need, but let's go ahead, let's go up here to Carlo. And let me just look at my actual phone. And what we're gonna use is, so it's 7E70. So like I said, this was the last phone to join my network. So I am gonna take that, I am gonna delete this. I'm gonna come back up here to my defined. I'm gonna add that in, save it. And now we are going to restart Home Assistant. Let's bring this over here. And you can see this closed down. We can also do an HA restart. I kind of like this one better. That's my Slack channel saying that Home Assistant is down. And now we are back up. And hopefully we will become here. And here we can see we changed to home. It was found um, back on the network. And now my automation should kick off. It's basically just really, really straightforward scripts. We use our known devices to find the devices. We add those devices into a family group and then based on family groups in automations, we do various things. So we can see that everything, uh, everything has a condition of group.family being home. And we can see under Home Assistant that if we go look at the group, 
group.family is in fact home. So as long as one person in the family is home, one person in the family is home, then automations will kick off and the house believes that someone's home. So that's how I fixed it. I got my new phone, super happy about that. Hopefully the quality of the videos will go up because I do phone, I do film all of my videos on the iPhone. So iPhone XS Max, hopefully the video quality increases. You guys enjoy it. We're almost at a thousand subscribers. So I also just wanted to say thanks everyone. I do really appreciate that. I'm not sure if you heard that, but the house did just recognize that I was here. In fact, if you click, if we click alarm panel, we can see that there was a message that went out. Good evening, Carlo is here now. Hashtag welcome home. Okay guys, till the next video. Bye.